So lots of people will also be celebrating Memorial Day weekend on the lake, but it's important to know how to keep yourself safe if you fall in the water. Yeah, it's something we unfortunately have to talk about every year, even around such a festive holiday. Yep. So wake up Charlotte's Billie Jean Shaw live this morning for us on Lake Norman. Billie Jean, you know, the tragedies on the lake are on the rise, but there are things you can do to be proactive. Good morning, Rob and Rachel. That's right. Do you know that in just a matter of seconds in just with inches of water, one person can drown. So can you imagine what can happen if you're in a massive lake like Norman? This morning, we are here with Master Officer Samson Parker from the State Wildlife Resource Commission. And we've been talking all morning about boating safety. Lake Norman, pretty deep. Absolutely. Lake Norman, can, in, in spots, is over 100 feet deep. And so because of that, it's important to have one life-saving tool on your boat. We have it right here. Explain to us what this is and why everyone should have it. This is a type four throwable device. Uh, if somebody goes overboard or is in trouble while they're swimming, you can use this to throw it to them. And it's actually required by law to have this on your boat. That's correct. Any boat over 16 feet is required to have a type four throwable life jacket. So we're gonna walk over here and show you exactly what you should be doing um, if you're in a situation this weekend or any other day when you're out on the boat and you're in an emergency where you see someone drowning. So if we're on the boat and I have a friend drowning, I'm not supposed to jump in after them. I think that's everyone's natural reaction. What should we do instead? That's correct. If you have somebody in the water, you've got two types of life jackets on your boat. You've got a type two, which is your wearable life jacket. You could throw this to them or you, use your, you need to use your type four throwable life jacket and there's a big difference on how far they go. Okay, so if you can actually show us how all of this works, guys, pay attention at home because you never know when you're going to need to know this. So this is your wearable life jacket. It's not gonna go very far. So if somebody's out further than that, you can take your Type 4 throw cushion, and it's designed to be able to go farther to help somebody. Wow. And then once that person is that's in the water, that's in distress, they have an emergency, they can actually grab onto that. That's correct. If they're able to put their arms through the loops, and they can just hold on to that Type 4 throw cushion until somebody's able to come over and get them. Master Officer Parker, thank you so much for waking up with us early here on Wake Up Charlotte for all of these important boating safety tips. We'll make sure to have all this information posted online as well at WCNC.com. Happy Memorial Day to you all, and please stay safe if you're coming out. Back to you. Great advice there. Billie Jean, thank you.